<clears throat> Hi everybody. As you suspected, I am doing a, a, the body works all. It's I can't. I'm always lying to you guys. I don't mean to lie. It just happens. I'm sorry. It's not my fault. Um but anyways, uh before I get into the haul, I just want to say today I worked the whole day. Today's Thanksgiving, I'm filming this. And um so I didn't technically go shopping on Black Friday, but I'm gonna name it Black Friday haul anyways. Because I'm not going to upload it until... I think I'm going to upload it this tomorrow, yeah, on Black Friday. And I worked all day, and then I went shopping a little bit at the mall. Lipstick of the Day is Santa Bay by Jeffree Star. Um, yeah. Perfume of the Day was, I think, Juicy Couture Gold Couture. Okay. So, I got a lot of fun things. I got... Just, the only things I got were hand soaps and body cam. So I'll start with the hand soaps first, and then I'll do body care. You guys, whew, girl. Okay, so let's start with the hand soaps. So everything, all this is from the Sweet Shop line, by the way. So we'll start with my favorite out of the hand soaps, out of the Sweet Shop hand soaps, and it's Crushed Candy Cane. I love how it matches the the cans all. Now this has Keynotes of Crunchy, Peppermint, White Sugar Crystals, and Frosted Mint Leaf. Oh, I think this was the one I opened, yeah. Mmm. My God. Okay, so now I have Candy Cane Bliss from last year, and I want to just do a little comparison for you guys. Mmm. Yeah, they're exactly the same. They're exactly the same. Which is weird because Candy Cane Bliss has different keynotes. It has winter peppermint, vanilla, and whipped cream. And this one has crunch, cr crunchy peppermint, white sugar crystals, and frosted mint leaf. So they're different, they're different notes. Um, but they smell exactly the same. So these two are exactly the same. I love Candy Cane Bliss. And I love Crush Candy Cane, all of it. It smells like a sweet peppermint candy. It's weird because it smells like a sweet peppermint candy cane. Like, you know, just a, just a regular candy cane. But then, like, it does have, like, this... The hand soap, anyways. The candle smells more peppermint. The hand soap smells more like... Maybe it's just in my head, I don't know. But I do smell that white sugar crystals that's in this. And I guess that's the vanilla whipped cream that's in this. So, it's not vanilla, though. Like, let me see. Because this last year... Yeah... Let's see. Okay, so this one is just a hint sweeter, actually. They, they, they're basically 99% exactly the same. But this is just a, a percent sweeter than this. But you do smell like the sweet sugary crystals or sweetness in, in the peppermint in this too. But you do get a little bit more of a sweetness in this one. But they are technically exactly the same. So yes, yeah, so I just wanted to do a comparison. I never really do comparisons, but I wanted to do a comparison for that. Okay, um, now let's do more hand soaps. So I have, okay, this one. I have one cinnamon caramel swirl. This is Keynotes of Golden Caramel, Warm Vanilla, and Brown Sugar. This one I think I like the packaging the most. This is just like the, um, the, the caramel cinnamon swirl I don't even know, candle that was Santa's workshop. It's in a different sense, though. Mmm, this smells a little bit like a cinnamon bun. This smells like the cinnamon bun hand soap that just came out this year. That's what it smells like. Just a little bit more um, of the cinnamon in this. Like a little more spicy. And not as sweet as the cinnamon roll, cinnamon bun hand soap that came out. But it's basically exactly the same. Like, this is, like, really sweet. You really get that frosting, cinnamon bun type of smell in this. Um, they're a little different, though. But they're they're pretty much the same. So I love this packaging. That I love how it's, like, yeah, it all goes together. The hand soaps, the body care, and the candles. Like, they all are cohesive. I like that. I think it's great. Um, okay. So I guess I'll do this one next, even though I didn't mean to. But I'll do this one next. This one's, like, my favorite. This one's not part of the Sweet Shop line. This is part of another different hand soap collection. Ice gingerbread. Now I got three of them. You got three? 
because I love them. This one's very different than the the gingerbread swirl or whatever hand soap that was last year. This one is is like the gingerbread icing. To, and that's the only keynote that's here is ice gingerbread. That's all it says. There's no other keynotes. That's basically what it is. I love the packaging. I think it's so cute. It reminds me of like the gingerbread cookies in Edward Scissorhands. Remember in the factory when he's making the Christmas cookies? That's what it looks like. Anyways, um, let's see. Yeah, it smells just like gingerbread. Like, this, I think, smells even more like gingerbread, like, than the, the candle. I don't even know. Like, this smells like the, a gingerbread cookie baking in the oven with vanilla icing. Like, this is what... I love this. So, I had to get three. Had to get three of them. Yes. Baby, yes. And this is the only one I got from that um, line. I didn't get any other ones from that line. Just because I didn't really like all the, uh, any of the other ones. I just didn't like them. Let me wipe my hands. Okay. You know, the hand soaps, they get messy when you open them. Okay, um, next let's do more hand soaps. So I got one of each of these. This is still, now it's back to the Sweet Shop Collection. Lemon Buttercream. Now this is the same one as last year. I think it was, I think it was called Lemon Buttercream last year too. I like Lash's packaging better only because like, this is cute. I mean, London's decorated for Christmas with a red bow, but I mean, I liked last year's a little bit better because it had like lemon cookies in the front of it. So I kind of like last year's better, but this is cute. Um, sugar, lemon, whipped vanilla, and graham cracker crumbles. Yeah, this smells just like the hand soap from last year. It smells like a lemon cookie. It's really nice. I really like it. Really, really good. But I only got one of these. Now I got like two, so I got one back up. It's not my favorite, but I do like it. And then I got one Merry Cookie, so I got a backup of Merry Cookie. I have one from last year. Buttery strawberry vanilla bourbon icing and sponge sugar. This one I love, and I love the packaging. Oh my god, this is so cute. This is crazy, because this year I liked the packaging of Merry Cookie better than last year, and the last year was cute. And then I liked lemon buttercream better last year than this year. So it's like, you know, some packagings are different than others. Yeah, I love Merry Cookie. There's something about about it though that it's not like oh my god hoard worthy like her hoard worthy like the gingerbread latte or like the crushed candy cane so I only got one but I mean it is nice it is nice I would recommend it it does smell like a shortbread cookie but there's some type of like artificial flavoring smell in it too it's making it a little weird but I do like it it's not my favorite. I gotta keep it real, but I do like it. Okay. And that's it for the hand soaps. Now let's do body care and holy shit. First of all, look at, I have three bags of these. Look, three bags. Three bags. I'm not even gonna pick up the other two because this is crazy. I should really put everything in one bag because this is crazy. I don't know which one to stop first. I guess I'll do the shower gels first and then I'm gonna do... Alright, let's talk about the collection. <clears throat> I don't get why Winter Candy Apple is included in this. It's, it, it, that one is definitely one that's kind of like shouldn't have been included. I feel like Winter Candy Apple is a weird um, scent to include in this collection, but they did. Um, it would have made more sense to include Vanilla B. Noel in this collection, to be honest with you, but they included Winter Candy Apple, whatever. Um, they have, that's the only one I did not get was Winter Candy Apple in this collection. I got all the other ones, right? I'm trying to think. Yeah, because I got, I got the Hot Taco Hot Cocoa Cream came back, and I got a couple of shadows in that, so let me show you that first. Okay, so I got two Hot Cocoa and Cream shadow gels. I have one from Lashes, and I have all, and I have three all together. So this is All Aboard the Cocoa Express, the sweetest way to a delicious land of rich velvety chocolate. Oh, this is a cute little paragraph back here. Creamy Cocoa Mini Marshmallows Vanilla Musk. Wow, this smells like a cup, a, cu a cup of like hot Swiss Hershey chocolate. It's so good. Um, as I said, the body care does smell like the candle. Not quite exactly the same, um, but they're similar. The only one out of the um, like the body care collection for hot cocoa and cream that does not smell like the candle is the fragrance mist. However, I still like the fragrance mist, and I spoke about that last year. But the cream in the shower gel does smell very similar to the candle. 
Um, the hand soap that came out in spring, I thought they were going to repackage it for the winter, which I'm really surprised they didn't. I guess they, I guess they still could. Like, uh, maybe there's another winter collection hand soap coming in January. I don't know. But, um, I'm surprised they didn't repackage that one, because that's more appropriate for winter anyways. But they had that one in the spring, and that one smelled exactly like the candle. But yes, yeah, so I got two shower gels, and the packaging's so cute. It's like a land of, like, Christmas wonderland. I don't even know. It's like a fairy... Wonder magic land. I don't even know. It's really cute. This kind of reminds me a little bit of like the night before Christmas like the like Christmas town So yeah, I do love the hot cocoa and cream. So I got two shower gels Um, Now out of the three new ones, I'm gonna do my least favorite first And then I'm gonna do my second to my second favorite and then my favorite favorite for last um, so this is my third favorite of the three new ones, Bright Lemon Snowdrop. I only got the shower gel on this, but the other two I got in all of, the whole enchilada. Okay, so stroll through a magical forest of lemon snowdrops and fill your heart with bright citrus cheer. Frosted lemon, citrus, marshmallow fluff, and vanilla bean. Okay. Now let me smell the hand soap, the lemon, because they look like they would be s similar or the same, but they're, I don't think they are. Mm. Yeah, okay. So you get more of a bakery note in the hand soap of lemon um, buttercream. Why is this? This one, this one is leaking. I don't even know why, but this one is like leaking. This is the one that's like leaking. I gotta wash that one afterwards and wipe that up. Okay, so you get more of the bakery note in hand soap, lemon buttercream. You get more of a shortbread bakery cookie smell with the lemon in that. This, honestly, you get that like vanilla, like cook, like cookie smell, but it's. The lemon is very strong in this, in, in the body care. Um, it's not my favorite. You know what I mean? It's just not my favorite. Stroll through, it's not my favorite. I have to keep it real. Because I want to do beats, so I gotta see like when it's coming. Okay. Yeah, this is not my favorite. But it's still good. If it smelled like the hand soap, it, I probably would have gotten the whole enchilada, but it doesn't. You smell more of like a lemon. Some people say it smells like lemon cough drops. I don't think I would go that far to say it smells like lemon cough drops. I mean, your first sniff, I mean, you get like this lemony, like very like, you get like a, like a lemon smell. And then you do get a little bit, it's kind of like the citrus swirl body care. Where it's like you get that citrus, but then you do get the vanilla underneath it, but it's not as strong. By the way, I smelled the citrus swirl again, and it's the so good in the cream. The cream does smell like a, um, you know, orange creamsicle. It really does. So the cream is really nice. The shower gel still get a lot more citrus, and the mist, kind of like the same story, but the cream you do get the vanilla cream with the citrus, so it's really nice. But this is kind of like the same story, where it's like you get that lemon, it's the the strongest note is the lemon and overpowers the like the vanilla or cookie smell that's in this. So it's not my favorite. I do like it though. Alright, now let me do my second. Now I was torn between these two because these two are so good. But I have one negative thing to say about each of these new scents. But all, mostly it's positive, but there is a negative. And I'm going to tell you right now. But this is my second favorite of the bunch. Um... Oh, I get them all together. Okay, so Christmas cookies. So now the shower gels are not the cute colors. They're just a regular clear color. In fact, this kind of looks yellow. So this kind of looks like they would be the lemon snowdrop shower gel, actually. I don't think they added color to it because it's a very sweet gourmand smell. And, like, I think sweet gourmand smells, when you add color to it, it changes the formula. So that's why I think they did not include a color with this. That's what I think. But, yeah, this is, I love the Girl, the packaging. Look at this. First of all, I didn't know from the pictures there was glitter all about this, but there's glitter all over it. It's snowing. It's a little Christmas Santa village. It's so cute. 
The mist has confetti, sprinkles all around it. Um, love that. And then, yeah, little Christmas village here. So, yeah, the packaging is A1. As I said, what they lacked for fall, they made up for for Christmas. Okay. I'm going to put the mist in the other one, but I'll put the cream one in this one. And I'll read you the keynotes. So the keynotes are Gay Sweet of the, on the Holiday with Ooey Gooey Sugar Cookie Goodness, Fragus Nose Creamy Cookie Dough, Almond um, Biscotti, Caramel Word. Caramel Wood. So just to tell you right off the bat with the fragrance mist of the new the new line. So that's Christmas cookies and that includes the blueberry, Santa's blueberry shortbread. The mist is very light. Um, you barely smell it. And that's my only complaint about this body care line is that the fragrance mists are very, very light. So you smell it and it smells amazing when you first spray it. But then like, I swear to God, five minutes later, you can barely smell it. Yeah. I think if you layer it, you should be okay. But if you just spray it once, it's going to go, it's not going to last. You have to keep layering it, like spray a few times. And then it should last longer than five minutes. Like it should last maybe an hour or so. But if you only spray like a light hand with it, it's not going to last. It's not. That's my only complaint with this. But in the creams, they're very strong. And they last in the creams. <sighs> okay. So I don't get cookie dough. I don't get cookie dough. This really does smell like a Christmas cookie smell, by the way. It's nothing like Vanilla Bean Noel. Vanilla Bean Noel is vanilla bean ice cream. Like, Christmas cookie vanilla bean. I think if they took away the vanilla bean out of vanilla bean Noel, I think it would be similar to this. But since they have that strong note of vanilla bean in that one, it's... It's not like Christmas cookies. Christmas cookies is very different because it does not have that vanilla bean note. Um, but you do get the caramel, like you do in vanilla bean Noel. So the caramel wood. I don't, it's not woodsy. It's. I'm not going to say it's like a sticky sweet caramel, but it's like a... Maybe like a maple leaf caramel. It's a type of like... It's not like sweet sweet caramel, but it's a little bit more dyed down caramel. But it's not woody. But you do get that caramel. You really get the almond biscotti. Because I'm Italian. I know I'm biscotti cookies. I've been eating them for my whole life. And this is almond biscotti. Now, it, you would think the smell... And I didn't get the body care, but it, I think it was vanilla chai and biscotti body care from years ago. I did not get that one, but I had a feeling this might smell similar to that. But I don't know because I didn't have it. But just the keynotes and everything kind of makes me think it would be similar to that. I get... This is what I get in a nutshell. I really get the almond biscotti. It's like an almondy Christmas cookie. So it's basically Christmas sugar cookies with almonds in it. With like drizzle of caramel. They're like caramel sugar Christmas cookies with almonds. That's what it is. So it's basically a tray of Christmas cookies. Like an assortment of Christmas cookies. That's what I think of this. Like an assortment of Italian Christmas cookies or something. Like that's what I think when I smell this. And it is bomb. A1. Awesome. Love it. Now, in the shower gel, of course, I haven't used it yet, but... The shower gel smells nice, but it's a very dyed down version. I think it smells the worst in the shower gel, by the way. Yeah, I don't like it in the shower gel, to be quite frank with you. It does not smell like that Christmas cookie that you get in the cream and the mist. It, they, it doesn't smell the same like those two. It's very different. It's a very dyed down, watery smell of it, and I don't like it, actually. But I got one shower gel. Um, but this, so strong, so sweet, like Christmas cookies. The, these are the winners. So if you were going to get... Oh my god. Hold on. My food's on the way. Okay, it's but. That's the Christmas cookies, my second favorite out of the line. My second favorite out of the whole new Christmas collection that came out there is a chocolate, like mint chocolate peppermint that's coming out in body care very soon. I might get that one. I probably shouldn't, but I'm probably gonna. But this one's my second favorite. So far, anyways. Okay, now let's do the blueberry shortbread, and this is my favorite one, so... Um, let me show you what I picked up in it. Okay. Again, the shower gel is clear. So this is called Santa's Blueberry Shortbread. Um, I got a cream, a mist, and two shower gels. Ooh. 
two shower gels. Okay. Now, the, the shower gel smells really nice. The shower gel, like in this scent too, smells like a little bit of a die down version of the actual smell, but it's, it's bearable in this. Christmas cookie, you don't even smell the Christmas cookie smell in the shower gel. But this you do, it's still like a die down version of it. So yeah, I got two shower gels. Two shower gels. Okay, now let's talk about the cream in the mist. Ah, I love the cream. Okay, let me read you what um, it says. This is Baked Blueberry Bliss and Santa Sweet Shop makes this the most wonderful time of the year. Okay, so this is the only scent. Maybe next to the lemon one. The lemon one, I don't feel like it's holiday related. But this one is holiday related, but it's kind of not. I think that when I smell this, oh my god. Baked Blueberry Crumble Shortcake Whipped Cream is the fragrance in us. Oh my god, let me just spray this on because this is like my favorite. <laughs> okay. I have the bubble bath right here. So I wanted to do a scent comparison with the bubble bath and see if it smells the same. It's very similar, yeah. This again is a little bit more of a die down version. The cream in the mist is very sweet, but this is a die down version of the scent. But it's still not, it's not as die down as a shower gel, but it's not as strong as the cream in the mist. But that's the bubble bath, but it is the exact same smell. Now this candle, which is the blueberry maple pancake from the fall. So let me, yeah, this is a, vi okay, so this is even sweeter and stronger than this. So this is very similar to this. So this scent is very similar to the blueberry maple pancake candle. If I had to say if it smells like anything similar to, nothing body care wise, but when it comes to anything else in, in Bath & Body Works that's similar to this smell would be that candle. But this really does smell like that blue Tootsie Pop. It's similar to it, but it's not exactly the same. This is literally blueberry pie. Like, it reminds me a lot of the 4th of July, by the way. Like, it just reminds me a lot of the 4th of July, especially with this, this the blue and this the white stars on it. This just reminds me of, like, 4th of July. Um, mm, okay, so you get everything. You get the baked blueberry, you get the crumbled chocolate cake, and you get whipped cream. But the, the bit, it's crazy, because, like, oh my god. It smells a lot like the blueberry pie lip scrub from Jeffree Star Cosmetics. It smells exactly like that, actually. If I if I had to say it smells like anything that I've smelled before is that lip scrub from Jeffree Star. But it smells like blueberry pie. Blueberry shortbread, I don't know what the difference is. I feel like shortbread cookies are like more like, ben, like I don't know, buttery, I guess. This smells like a blueberry pie on the 4th of July. It's not Christmas. I don't think a... I don't think, when I when I smell blueberries and blueberry pie and blueberry crumb cake and stuff, I don't think of Christmas or the holiday season. I think of the 4th of July. But it really does smell like a warm baked blueberry pie in the oven. I mean, you get that sweetness of like that crumb, crust, shortcake type of like note. And then you get that sweet blueberries. I mean, it is... And then you do get like maybe a little, the whipped cream isn't that noticeable, but you do get a little bit of like that whipped cream on top. Oh, it is delicious. It is my favorite one. I love this. In fact, if there was, if I were to make it out of the top 10 favorite body care of Bath & Body Works of all time, this would definitely be in the top five even. Out of the top 10 would be probably the top five. It's that good. Like I love it. And it's very strong in the cream. In the mist, again, it's very light because all, the whole line in the mist are, are light. Don't know why, but it is. But hey, the mists are normally lighter anyways. I mean, but it is lighter than usual in the mist. But mists are light anyways, as I've said before. Um, that's why there's so, so much product in here and you spray it, keep spraying it. It's really good. And again, if you do do a heavy spray, it should last. It's so sweet. It's so delicious. It, it does smell like... Mm. Oh my god, it really smells like blueberry pie. Oh my god. Yeah, blueberry pie. Very sweet blueberry pie. And it's not artificial either. It smells like an authentic blueberry pie smell. It's crazy. I think this is my favorite blueberry smell that Bath & Butterfuss has ever made. Honestly. 
It's that good. So yeah. So I got two shadow gels that came in meth. Okay, so that's it. That was my best fireworks haul. I hope you guys enjoyed. I got a lot of shit. A lot of shit. I just bought a lot, put a lot of things in. And I saved a lot of money, of course. But I put a lot of stuff in the um, thing. I got no candles because I've already bought so many candles. So I got no candles. So I just got hands with body care. So I hope you guys enjoyed my Bath and Body Works haul. I'm going to upload this tomorrow. So I'm going to upload this on Black Friday. Um, today's Thanksgiving. So happy Thanksgiving to everyone. Um, who celebrated? I didn't celebrate it because I was working and then I just went to the mall. I mean, I was I work at the mall, but I worked and then I just went shopping around the mall. Anyways, so... I do recommend this whole line. The things I recommend the most out of the hand soaps are the Ice Gingerbread and the Crushed Candy Cane. Out of the Body Care, Christmas Cookies and Santa's Blueberry Shortbread. I recommend the most in Body Care. In the Cream, the most. It smells the strongest and the best in the cream. Then the Mist. And then the shower gel. The shower gels, I don't know why, but in this line, it's just a very watered down version of it, you know. But yeah, um, yeah, I love you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'm gonna go because my food's here now. Um, as I said, lipstick with Santa Bay by Jeffree Star. Um, I had my perfume was Juicy Couture, Viva La Juicy, Gold Couture, but in the small, like in the Bath and Body Works, so I just kept spraying everything. Oh my god, I just was like, oh, um, I was just spraying everything. Yeah. <laughs> I was spraying everything. Um, now, I could say I'm not going to do another Bath and Body Works haul, but I mean, would you believe me? I don't even believe myself when I say it, to be honest with you. So, um... I will probably do another one if I like the chocolate peppermint smell and if uh, and body care. If I like it and I get it, I will do a haul on that. But I don't think I'm going to get any more hand soaps or candles. I think I'm just going to get that one body care thing. The, the mint chocolate peppermint, whatever that's called. I'm going to get that. But that's all I'm going to get. If, if I do like it. And the only reason why I say if I... I the, only, the only reason why I say if I like it is because... It has peppermint in it. And with Bath & Body Works peppermint smells, it has a strong peppermint cooling sensation, Ben Gay type of like sensation on the skin. And that's why I'm like, if it has that, then I'm not getting it. Even if it smells bomb AF, like it smells like the candle, I am not getting that body care. If the peppermint in the fragrance has that cooling sensation on the skin, I'm not getting it. Just keeping it real. I'm not gonna, because I would never wear it. No matter how good the smell is. Like, I love Twisted Peppermint to death, but I can never get it because it has that cooling sensation and it's annoying because if it did not have that cooling sensation, I'm kidding you not, it would probably be one of my favorite body care smells of all time when it comes to Christmas. Just keeping it gangsta. But I don't like that cooling sensation. It ruins the whole thing for me. So if the chocolate peppermint one has it in body care too, I'm not getting it. I hope it doesn't, but you never know. All right, I love you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. Hope you guys have a happy Thanksgiving. Enjoy, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.